Hey YouTube, Midwest Coin Hunter here, and today's video we're going to be searching through this $250 box of dimes and pretty much just looking for silver. But if we find anything else interesting in here, we'll certainly pull it out. So let's uh, open it up and check the ends. And they definitely are circulated. All right. Well, let's get into these and see if we can find anything. All right, guys. I'm about 10 rolls into this box, and it looks like we have silver. And a Merc. 1942. Don't see a mint mark on there. Awesome. Oh, wait a second. I think we have another one in here. Right there. Let's see if that's the case. Oh my gosh, two mercs in the same roll, guys. Oh! This is a 19... Gosh, that looks like a 1920. Hold on, let me see if I can... I got kids in the background here. That looks like a 1920. See if it has a mint mark. Yeah. No mint mark, but two marks in the same roll. Roll, excuse me, a 42 and a 1920. Awesome. All right, so here are the finds after searching that $250 box of dimes. We found a couple of silver, and both of them were mercury dimes, and both of them were found in the same roll. The first one here. get it to focus it was a 1942 plain date love the mercury design and I almost missed this one because I was so excited about finding the first one we have a 1920 plain date really cool uh, to find one with uh, such a um, uh, one of the earlier years this is definitely an older mercury dime here um, it is the plain date and so it doesn't have as low of a mintage as the Denver and San Francisco um, minted coins I believe the plain date uh, was around just under 60 million I think uh, minted um, if it were uh, a Denver uh, I believe that was uh, just under 20 million, and I think the San Francisco was around 13. Not 100% on those numbers, but uh, anyway, um, you find these older ones. If you can get the ones with the right uh, mint marks on them, they're definitely worth some money. But uh, not this one. Probably still worth a couple of bucks, but uh, I'm happy just to, to have found it anyway. So this was a fun hunt. Uh, this one here fooled me. I was uh, throwing my uh, return dimes back in the bin and I looked down and I noticed this one and I thought I had thrown a silver back in. Tell me that doesn't look like silver. But it is not. It is a 67. And I've noticed a lot of the uh, 65, 66, 67 in those years. A lot of times they they just have that silver look to them, but uh, that one definitely fooled me. So anyway, we'll add this silver to our stack. Hope you enjoyed the video, and until next time, we'll see you later.